Hello! Today we are reading the story and it has the title Hands and Fingers. The author who wrote the words is Pam Schiller. The photographer who took the pictures is Rochelle Bartquick. The photographer takes the pictures and the author writes the words. Remember, we always start with our title at the top. Hands up, hands down, hands twirling round and round. Fingers up, fingers down, fingers dancing all around. Dance your fingers in the air, and in your hair, and on your knees. Dance your fingers here and there. Dance your fingers everywhere. Hide your hands between your knees. Fly them out like buzzing bees. Behind your back, one, two, three. Where, oh where could your fingers be? Bring your fingers back in sight. Fly them left and fly them right. Around and around and around they go. Now place them in your lap just so. Let's see if we can hear any rhymes as we reread this story. Dance your fingers here and there. Dance your fingers everywhere. Do you guys hear a rhyme? I hear a rhyme with here and there and everywhere. Those words rhyme. Hide your hands between your knees. Fly them out like buzzing bees. Knees, bees. Do those sound the same at the end? Let's listen. Knees, bees. Those sound the same at the end. Those are rhyming words. Behind your back. One, two, three. Where, oh where could your fingers be? Three and B both end in the E sound. Three and B are rhyming words. Bring your fingers back in sight. Fly them left and fly them right. Let's listen. Left, right. Do those rhyme? No. Sight, right. Do those rhyme? Yes. Let's listen. Sight. Right. Those sound the same at the end, so they're rhyming words. Very good. Now we are going to draw a picture of our hands and fingers. So yesterday, you should have drawn a body. To draw a body, a lot of times you just draw a circle, a line, two arms, and two legs. This is a body, and it does have enough parts that you can tell that it's a person. But when we add more details, we get a better body. On this picture, I added colors, I added hair, I added eyes, a nose, a mouth, big arms, I have shoulders, I have shoes on, but you know what I'm missing? I'm missing my hands. This body doesn't have any hands. So you're going to need to add some hands to your body. Let's count how many fingers you have before we start trying to draw a hand. One, two, three, four, five. We have five fingers. So to draw a hand, you are going to draw a thumb and then you're going to draw four fingers so that our hand has one, two, three, 
two, three, four, five fingers. We have five fingers on each hand. So let's add another one. One finger, two, three, four, five. Sometimes my hands look a little bit funny, but that's okay because I know that I drew five fingers, so it has the right number of fingers, even if it looks a little funny. I'm going to color in my hands so that they look skin color. Great. So now I have five fingers on this hand, and let's count how many I have on this hand. One, two, three, four, five. Let's find out how many fingers we have all together. Do you want to count on your hands or you can count along with my picture? One, two, three, four, five. Now we're going to our next hand, but we're going to keep counting higher. Six, seven, eight, nine, 10. When we hold up two hands, that is 10 fingers. The number 10 looks like this. It's a one and a zero. This is the number 10. We have 10 fingers five on each hand. I'm so excited to see your body that has lots of detail. You can add colors, you can add hands, add feet, add clothes to your person. I can't wait to see it. Thank you. Goodbye.